Kish coming to you live to try, uh, let's try not to die, but today we're playing Vampire instead of Minecraft, so not the usual, and as you might have noticed, uh, camera installed today, so, yeah, awesome, let's get this, uh, going then, shall we? So I've never played this game before, so, uh, yeah, but I was, um, told about it by my brother, so he suggested it, so let's said that I would be, uh, I would like it, so, let's have a look. Jesus. This, uh, loading time is doing me in, but it's fine, it's worth it, I suppose it's the first time it's, like, loading up the game, so, we can forgive it. Just waiting. <laughs> hey, Poe. Come on. Come on. Come say hi. Come say hi. It's a good boy. Oh, you're being shy, eh, mate? Look. I'm gonna come say hi. <laughs> oh, yeah. You ready to play this? Are you ready? I was ready years ago, but it seems to be taking a while. Okay. Oh, we're gonna go in normal mode. I don't know whether I'm gonna be okay with this, but apparently you get bigger rewards the better you get to know people in this game i'm kind of interested in that aspect of it so like his uh his hoping that it's all right now i have the sound coming through my tv if you want me to turn it down obviously mention it but i'm hoping that you can't hear it that well but i would like to hear it myself but yeah Twelve dreams for the Red Queen under In fact, I could probably get it to go. Hold on. Let's change this, shall we? Uh, the, the, the wrong thing. Hold on, I'm just changing what comes out to my headphones. Seeing if I prefer it like this. Maybe I do. Oh, maybe I do. Okay, I can't remember what I did. Okay, so. Born from eight restless nights, four nails piercing the flesh of the sinner, one prayer for the summoned called by this song. <coughs> Tis perhaps the countdown to oblivion for the once proud city of London. Tis perchance her inhabitants last dance alone to face death and mm. pestilence. Confronted by the eerie and unknown, mortals became desperate for answers. A flock of became desperate for an omen, the falling of a star, a dire presage. Turning to priests for interpretation when there was no reason to be found. When religion failed, men turned to science. Oh, this is such a huge... I saw them build such vain cities, crafting machines made for endless war. New questions flourished as old answers withered. What is darkness? But lurking sun. Wow, what so is deep. War, but enslaved stone. What is glass? But tortured sand. What is song? But a <laughs> sounds like arms. my uh, school books what when I was an emo. But jilted love. What is life? But death pending. <sighs> wow. That was a deep dive. Death. Since the apple was plucked from the you can see this is going to be a really like lively game. to be God's punishment, a righteous <laughs> to keep mankind. And if I don't ship my pads, they were all so wrong. Death is not a wicked thing, nor some holy retribution. A true punishment. <laughs> Are you acting like you've done something wrong, mate? Good. Awaken from the harshness and be born once more. Mm. 
Okay, so that's me. I know that much. Oh, this is so intense. <laughs> My dog pose is giving me his paw. I don't know. He just wants his attention at the moment. Assume and follow this blood. Mm. Sus. Okay. I think we're about to get a, get a drink, buddy, I think. We'll be okay. Oh no, tripping. I think. I mean, not that I don't appreciate it, but there's so much, like, guff with this. I have no idea what's oh okay. I kinda get what's going on but Done, uh, done a remake. Hold on, please, hold on. You just get right choked into it, apparently. So. Some lunch. Shit, let it come. Now I can defend myself. Okay, right. I thought I had to like Turn find some of the skill. Who are you? Stay back. Okay, all well, I know is square. But you left me no choice. Let's 
fuming up here. Who are you, stupid beast? I'm not sure right now, to be honest. Sorry. Okay, I'm assuming I did it right there. No, please stop. Do I get any other options or buttons? I should really try them out, really. Well, let me just make sure that stays. I mean you no harm. I I need help. Die, you fucking leech! <laughs> Please, Oops. listen to me. I can't make any sense of this. Shut up, beast! Who are you? What is this all about? Ah! What in God's sake? I'll do the rest ah, of the job. Ah, just, just leave me. Ah, 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 ah. <laughs> Puppy's just decided to. Well, dogs decided to sit on the armchair because it feels like it's burning me to the bone. That's so dark. I need to find somewhere to hide. Let me go! Well, where, am I, where am I supposed to be freaking going? Alright, well. Okay. I need to find shelter! I'm assuming then that, okay, I thought I had to literally find somewhere to hide, but. <laughs> Is anybody there? Not too shabby. This seems abandoned. I should be safe enough here. Should another do another? Hold on, guys. Had a bit of a malfunction. Yeah, that's fine. <laughs> I lost you guys for a second. Just trying to, because uh, my controller is running out of charge. So I had to move it, I'm afraid. Okay, what are we doing? Totally zoned out when I was supposed to be paying attention. I can almost feel the sun's rays like a physical weight pressing against the wood. Okay, let's look. Uh, leeches do not fear the sun or fire, and they do not burst into the flames or ashes when they are caught under rays of daylight, but it hurts them. Good. Really good. I have personally chained a vampire to a tree to see what would happen. Okay, so basically it's just somebody saying. Uh, yeah. Alright, fair enough. Fair. Oh, collectible. In the bank. Been banked. Some shillings. Nice. Brother. <laughs> what? Mary! Mary! Mary, I'm sorry. Whoever did this to us, I will find them. Was that his sister? I don't even know why I think that's his sister. Why was that? Is it? I don't remember. Is that something I need? No. No, that was just the door. Just in games like this where you can like interact with stuff, I just feel like I need to look at everything. I don't know whether I'm going to be spending a lot of 
call him Mason, but <laughs> Purdy. She got a Purdy mouth. Wait, this one's dressed up fancy. Let's run through his pockets. Picking the dead's pockets? Are you serious? I've still a rent to pay. He's got no more responsibilities. What's this? Go watch. Beautiful it is. We fancy it and share the takings. <laughs> I suppose we are undertakers. <laughs> now, give him an eve. Oh, I might need to set up straight, That's but impossible. my controller is charging. So I break my bank back. I'm gonna have to sit up straight like a dweeb, but I'm no back to lean on. Right, so I've checked that, I've checked that, da da da. Okay, well, upstairs then I take it. What you got for me? Just searching the house, taking a nice tour. I need to wash my hands as. Oh! Gonna be the mirror bit in it. <laughs> I have no reflection. Who goes there? Why does that sound like Snape? Who's there? You referring to me? <laughs> no, no, I still have so much to accomplish. I still have so much left that needs doing. <sighs> Taking cash being one of those things. I kind of want to just trot about. I don't want to have to run everywhere. Hmm. They did just follow you, don't they, mate? to leave and now no. there's time I can save him that's the enemy coming the orders are to evacuate the hospital <sighs> done he'll live and now what we fight killing is a hell of a lot easier than healing mm. so we're going rogue no, it never got easy. Hmm. Got some character building going on here. Nope. Anything there? Nah, okay. Yep, what's there? Okay, so diary. Nice. What's this what? I sleep? Fair enough. This makes no sense. None of it. No sense at all. Is he just gonna go to sleep? Mad. It's a nightmare. That's it. Didn't think it is. Okay. 
Got no choice, man. I really want to use this controller without the charger. <laughs> Maybe... Maybe I'll go away with it for a little bit, eh? Ugh. I've got time for this. Oh, yeah. So much better. This is absolute madness. I've lost touch with a real... <laughs> Evolution. Hideout birds allow you to evolve and rest. Spend experience points to level up and sh improve your vampiric skills. Okay, well. Autopathy. Where? Okay. This one? Okay, yeah. Do, 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 do. Alright, so. Uh, parts of the vampire uses power of his blood to heal um, normal and aggravated damage. Nice. Okay. Oh, okay. Well, I didn't actually like do anything to it, and then do what like this. Okay. Oh. An aggressive skill. What do I want? Yeah, seems quite cool. Shadows kinda cool. I kinda like the shadow mist. I think it's kinda cool. Might have be the wrong one in hindsight, but I did pick that didn't I? Oh. Yeah. Okay, okay. Confirm. Yay. I'm so, you know, I'm not sure if I want to do this, but yeah, then I'm like, yeah, I'll add some skills on there. That voice in my head. Do you know somewhere near the East End docks? I suppose I don't know this part of town. All I know is someone is killing people here, murdering them, butchering them, drinking their blood, making them like him. Is this what happened to me? My poor Mary, my poor sister. Okay, it's the sister. I must follow the blood trail. Find answers, maybe. I should start by gathering information about what happened to this place while I was away. Then I will find who did this to me. Who made me what I am now. Reach North Bank. Identify and confront the vampire who created me. Okay, right, fair enough. Just so I got that in my head then. If I'm not mad, then... It must belong to the one who made me. Hold on, I'm changing the... I cannot see and I cannot believe that you could probably see. Why did I do it on that? I don't want it on gameplay. I want it on video. Set brightness. Yeah, because I just think that it's a bit too... Yeah, see, I can't even see any symbol. Wait, oh, okay. Yeah. Oh, that's so much better. What I am. Oh, it's not... I must find yeah, him to I can understand see stuff, though. what I have become. I reach the North Bank. I guess that I'm not searching anymore. So it's just to, like, literally leave this place. Wow. 
Oh, okay, creepy. Uh, it's closed. These people want me dead. I need to leave now. Wow. Okay. Uh, yeah, you're right there, cooperative gamer. Sorry, I'm uh, just well interested in what was happening here. Here's the leech. Here! Ooh. Tense moment, so sorry. Good, good to hear, mate. My head's spinning. It's locked. Okay, my well, it just doesn't hurt to check, does it? That's locked. Okay, what, what, what am I going to be using? Okay. Sake, press triangle, da 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 da. Right. I'm still in Southwark. I must reach the West End. Go back home. Huh. <laughs> yeah. It's about right. Die, Fermi! That is a strength. A what? strength I oh, never knew I had. Crazy. Oh, this one stinks already. Oh. Can't do that yet. Yeah. She's dead. The fact that she probably deal with him. No, we want this skeezer here. Nice. Every fiber of my being is a fire. Sorry, uh, hold on, I'm a little bit. Limits of my body. Um, not too sure really as of yet. Just sort of feeling out the game a little bit first. I've never played it yet. Just kind of got uh, recommended it by my brother. Cool. Okay. Oh. Oh, lucky. Shit in hell. Sorry, mate, I'm a bit, uh, was concentrating on that and half getting it wrong. Am I getting the PlayStation 5? Um, I'm not sure, to be honest. I think I would rather save up for a PC, to be honest. Um, but we'll see really because uh, like I just would prefer PC I've always preferred PC gaming but uh, yeah why are you are you thinking of getting one I have to actually concentrate on this Oogies because otherwise I'm just going to fail again and uh, look a right knob. Oh no, wait. I might really back from here. Shoot. Over there. Oh my god. Oh my god. Yep, it did not go as well as the last one. Not been bitten. Stupid beast! Oh, no, not him. This.
Oh, I'm gonna get mashed. Need to move out of the way. Every fiber of my being is a fire. Wow, that's actually a little bit. Like, ooh. Hold on, geese. I am so not getting at what who's whose blood am I consuming this guy's or what? I don't get <laughs> am I being stupid or what? I'm swear I'm pressing the buttons, but Yeah right, see you later mate. Yeah. You're right. What am I not getting with that? I've got to really concentrate, man. I wasn't going to get rage that I can't even get past that. I just didn't get it. I don't know if my got sticky buttons or what. Ideally, I just don't want to get to the point where I have to heal myself. This is... Yeah, you're right, I'm just checking if I can just do this bit. No, I cannot. Great. Well, that's fantastic. I just want to check, but it will not let me. Right, well, let's just start with this. If I knew, should have been paying attention. Okay, yeah, okay, fair enough, that's how you do it then. Okay, let's just... Whoop! Just keep avoiding it. You won't have to heal yourself anyway, you won't have to bail all the time. Oh, thank Fudge for that. My reflexes. I couldn't have handled the I'm like failure of not being able to do that for a third time. Right, well. Look at this away. How the frick do I get that way? Am I supposed to go in here or what? I guess. Maybe there's an upstairs. Yeah. Awesome. Woohoo! They're going up there. Your king and your country need you. Join the British ranks and help the brave lads at the front. Oh, okay. Awesome. Right, well, that's just going to be a load my of them places. If only I had controlled my need for blood. No, you didn't, Mary, did you? someone will pay for what happened to you. That's going to be what locked. happened to us. I cannot yeah. enter. Uh... Oh, okay. What's this? <laughs> I believe in doing this. 
Yeah, I can't believe it either, mate. Oh, okay, well. <laughs> it's just so funny. Right, well, let's leave them rats alone. Oh, okay. Right, we're gonna be told to do something, surely? Was I even given a thing to do? Oh, right, okay, there we go. The dizziness from the jump. I can now control it. Oh, deep. I think it's locked. It's got these bitches on lock, though. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Well, if I still need some, then whatever. I have this thirst for blood. Need them rats. What will London have to say to me? Heck. So many questions unanswered. Oh, my back hurts. My back is ouchy. Another corpse. Have the very streets of London become a mausoleum? Been drained Brothers. of all blood, but I can still smell the scent of it. I follow the scent's trail. Perhaps it will lead me to my assailant. Oh, okay, Blood. I see. The smell is so strong. Where has everyone gone? To sleep. Oh. Okay, fair. So, right. I take it. Oh, okay. There is stuff here. Right. I guess. <laughs> I guess. No, well, I don't think I need to. Let's see what's here. Right. Well, in bed. What's this? Some stash of things. We don't need the bed. To be fair, and I doubt we can make anything right now. Meh. Nice to have a look what these things do, though. Right, let's go. Oh wait, no, there was a trail around here. Where, what, where was that? Where was that? Do 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 do. Oh, it was on the other side of the wall. We don't need to be here. Oh, like I suspected in the first place. Right, so we need to go down here. That's strange. The trail is very erratic, as if the killer was drunk or hesitant. In this sort of time, day and age, probably. Oh, okay, I see. I know what this is. So, like, because you've got to get to know them, don't you, to... At last, a little life. <laughs> Ooh, should I just talk to whoever? Good evening, sir. I wondered if I could ask for your help. Wow, you look like you need a drink. Yes. I apologize for my outfit. It's been... It's been a long night. I've slain. Been there, seen that. Don't worry, things can only get worse. Hmm.
Has anybody entered the bar recently? Can't say. Sorry. I spent the night <laughs> making love to that gorgeous... Oh, I was going to say TMI, this is mate, important, but... sir. Are you sure no one has come in here in the last few hours? I don't know and I don't care. This is a free country. People still have the right to come and go, don't they? Mm-hmm. What's going on around here? It's like everybody is hiding. You must be new here. Have you not heard about the murders? Everybody fears to return oh, to the sewer dog. Who is this sewer dog? It's a local bogeyman. Convenient answer for every crime that happened for decades. You murdered someone. Blamed a sewer <laughs> dog, eh? Oh, I think I guess it is. I'll leave you to your bottle then. Letters, dude. What about the bartender? The bartender oh, always knows yeah. things. You look like Jonah's whale just spat you out of hell. Can I get you a drink? You did? No, thank you. How did you guess? I'm not, not thirsty. Well, grab a chair and get some rest. This is going to be another long night. Oh, I'm looking for someone. I'm looking for someone who might have passed through here recently. Well, yeah, now I'm kind of wishing I chose the Quiet first one. Tonight. The only other person I've seen went straight up to his room. <laughs> Thought it was kind of rude, actually. You mean he's still <laughs> so here? have a drink with oh, you, yeah. mate. He paid for the entire week. I'm so rude. I need to meet this man. I have... Questions. Just climb the stairs and knock on the first door. I heard him open his window, so I guess he's still awake. And, sir, uh, yes, no funny business. You hear me? Uh, this is a respectable establishment. Excuse me. Oh, second, I can have a tell. I think drink no longer stirs me. Feel like we need to chat to this lady. I get some insider's knowledge. Hello, sir. Some stock. Are you all right? Is there any way I can help you? I don't know. Maybe you could just talk to me. Maybe you prefer to speak with Tom then. He's more agreeable talking to strangers. Mm hmm. I just want to talk. I didn't mean to scare you. I'm not afraid, sir. It's just I've other customers to take care of. Oh, yeah, it was empty. I only see one customer. Huh. Oh. Well, yeah, of course. I mean, I best check on them. Oh, wow. Okay. Well, goodbye. I'll leave then. Thank you. To our lady, you went looking like you had something interesting to say, to be fair, sir. Yeah. Okay, I'll the Prewen has several patrols roaming the area. They do not pursue me. But they're looking for vampires, and they're most efficient. They'll not relent so. until the killer has been identified. I have a common objective, but I require... Shh. I think someone is eavesdropping. Mm -hmm. You dumb straight. You might as well come in, whoever you are. It is I. Slowly, vampire! <coughs> Who are you? Well, I, I mean you no harm, saith the vampire. Present yourself. Okay. I, I need a word. Anyone. I guess it's as good as mine. Please. <sighs> Well, that's something I can do for you. Nice tash. And who might you be? That's quality. Mm. Tell me, who are you? First, tell me what you, you came want. to him, to be fair. Then I may tell you. That's none of your concern. 
Sir, you have entered my room in the middle of the night, pale as a corpse and shaking like a tree. So please, indulge me. Something, someone, <laughs> is molesting people. In fact, killing them. Biting them. The calling card of a vampire. Like if you put the kinks, I guess. Um... You seem the expert. expert. How would that be? I have my secrets, as you have yours. Then if you are not a vampire, who or what are you? Van Helsing. Dr. Edgar Swansea of the Brotherhood of St. Paul. I am performing an independent investigation here in an attempt to understand precisely what is going on. And what exactly is this Brotherhood? Sir, if the name Brother is not Hedda's familiar to you, then deal. we shall discuss it another time. Then help me find the culprit. I may. If you'll first tell me why you opened this door. I followed a trail. The scent of blood from a recent victim. It led me here. You thought I was your aggressor. That explains a great deal. We are both chasing the same shadow. Hmm. A shadow, indeed. Yet I heard his voice in my head. There was a moment I believed I was mad. And he wasn't taking crap. You should let either. me handle this affair. You've no idea what you're up against. No. I will find the monster. He is I'll mine. find the molester. How will you do any better than I? But then let me ask you this. What are your intentions if you find the killer? Melissa Beck. Um. I'll demand answers. I will at answers. last have the answers to my questions. Hmm. Then I can only wish you good hunting. And pray we shall meet again. Well, the music's well intense in this game. Back the car and interrogate the locals. <laughs> That's weird, isn't it? Hmm, healthy. Yeah, so. Is there anything out here? No. no. Oh, if Swansea okay, is not my attacker, it means somebody else came here tonight. Someone must know something. <coughs> Not long ago, again. Me a laugh. Welcome back. Did you find what you were after? I can't say I have. Are you sure no one else came into your bar before I arrived? I need answers. I, you, I need answers the now. Ah. Uh, okay. Uh, I think you're hiding something from me. I hide many things from many people, sir. That's what my job's about. Alright, so we'll find this hint that you require. It's gotta be the lady, in it? She it's definitely knows. She's been listening to it. Evening, sir. Can I help you? I have a few questions for you. <sighs> well, this time you, you will answer me. Okay. I wonder. What is this place? I'm is pretty sure if you ask them more, you probably know tail. them more, I'm the which means their blood would be worth if more. Are you always open this late at night? No, it's only since the epidemic started. Tom thought that people may need a safe place to stay. Hmm, nice. You don't seem to have much business. Nice of him. Where is everybody? Well, most people are sleeping right now. And those that are awake tend to avoid going out. What with the murders and all. Hmm. Interesting. I spoke to Dr. Swansea. He's not the man I'm looking for. Now, I want the truth. The truth? What do you mean? I suspect that someone else was here tonight. And I don't think Tom wants to tell me about it. I'm just the barmaid here, okay? Mm. If Tom says yeah. you're the only visitor Everything. we had, then you're the only visitor we had. I can feel your fear, madam. Please, tell me what's going on. <sighs> it's Will. William Bishop. Well, that took a lot of effort. Tonight and he... Well, I thought he was going to clock someone. Wow, um, okay, so... 
Tell me about this William Bishop. Will was a sailor. Mr. Bill. Who worked Bill at the canning factory before he lost that job. A nice bloke, really. He's never been violent. Until mm. tonight. Why keep it a secret? Why not tell me about it? Tom's nothing if not loyal. After Will lost his job, he offered him one ear. They used to be good mates. But recently, well... I like the vibe of this game. It's pretty good. Very aggressive. I see. Thank you for your candor. I'll be sure to talk to Tom. Got time for this. I'll see one I had to do this with. Aha, uh -huh, yes, he wants a hint, so, yep. I uh, got it. Whispery whispers. I know your secret, boy. You again. What can I do for you? The truth this time. Bull of shitting. Tom, Bird talk face. to me about the visit from your old friend, William. Yes, Will came by tonight. But he's not my friend anymore. Oh. Diddies. Diddums. Why lie to me if he is not your friend? I didn't lie. I said you were my only unannounced customer and that's <laughs> the truth. Who is, who is he? Is he? Just an old sailor who loves his gin too much. He worked for years at the canning factory before it closed. How was he tonight? How was he tonight? <laughs> was, was his wife all right? Sicker than usual, perhaps. He whined and mumbled about how mean people were to him and how he'd like to talk to me outside. And then he left when I refused. Hmm. Is, is he dangerous? dangerous? Yeah. Like many drunks, he's all bark and no bite. He can barely stand up most of the time. Barely stand up most of the time. I need to find him. It's a matter of urgency. Do you know where he is? You could try his boat. It's up by the North Pier. He sleeps there when he's too drunk to get home. Please describe him to me. What do you expect? He's a tall, sick bastard with a bad rash and torn old clothes. William used to be strong, now he's a mess. Thank you, Tom. If you see him, tell him I don't want him back here unless he cleans up his act, okay? Alright, Papa. Can be done to get out of this bullshit mess. No. Inspector the Butters. Which way was it? No, 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 no. Wrong burn. So... Was it out here or was it this, uh, this way? Okay, well, these shoes definitely say these this way. Speak to the boats. Oh, okay, so the boats are there. I should have gone that way. I d I don't know, right? Go that way, we don't actually need this anymore, do we? Let's get to the docks. To I the will boats. get to the bottom of this intrigue. What's been done to me? So to this city. Where was it that I actually needed to go? That way. There's blood over there. Oh. The body is still warm. This man has just been drained of blood. Nom nom nom. Examine that This man was armed. He tried to defend himself. Is this well nice? What's this? Some sort of note. Uh, Blood and empty gin bottles. This bishop fellow is something of a heavy drinker. Mm -hmm. This corpse has been dried of its blood, just like the previous victim. More there around. are blood splats on the other side of the canal. I must reach that barge. Right. Say no more. Uh huh. For this way. Okay. Over there! 
Oh, yeah, yeah. Jumping all about and I can just play him. Oh, okay, wow. Nice. Where are we going now? Fix with this. Ammunition crate. Good. I may need a lot of bullets. I feel yeah. like I'm back on okay. the front line again. I'm going up here. Man. Shut that foolish man. What's that even supposed to go up here? I don't actually think so. the other dude already. Nice. What did I get from this dude anyway? Can he leave me any goodies? Any goodies? Yep. Nice. Yum, 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 yum. Have I got to kill all these people? Oh, there's blood down there. Yeah, okay, so I do need to follow them. Oh, well. We won't see any of these bastards back here again. What's that? Stay close. Keep an eye on each other. Okay. Creepy. I just like to have a go at this stuff. It's kind of cool. Oh. I like their screams when you burn them alive. Wow. Power play. Just sneak up to him. <laughs> what am I doing? Right. Off you, brilliant. Right, blood went out this way. Oh, okay, that's right. I thought like I had missed out. Another one. Is this the same one? No, it's different. So, I want to know what I can actually do in here because we've yet to know yet. We feel, oh, no, 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 no. See, I don't know. If it does much, but whatever. 
You can sleep. I think we want to maybe. Oh, I want to see if I can make anything. Cause it would be cool. Firearms. Can I upgrade that? <laughs> so, oh, I can actually get new ones. Awesome. Get my blood capacity up. Or yeah. Have some of that. Thank you. Can I get this one? Yep. Cool. Can I get anything else up? Can I get this? No. Okay. Oh, 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 oh. No, confirm. Yay, okay. The following night. I just happen to be able to just sleep when I want to sleep. Uh, drag the killer. So where am I actually... Went through this way. Fresh blood. The whole building reeks of it. The scent is so strong it makes me dizzy. Okay. Something tells me that we did end up the right way. Do I do that? Collectibles, inventory. is bedeviled. I must put it down. Proud of myself, to be honest with you. Right, 
So, I was the victim. Are you the victim? Yeah. William was an honorable man. I could have saved him. Mr. Hampton, are you in there? We knew him well. Another lost soul, a kindred spirit. Sir, listen to the sound of my voice. I am... I'm a doctor. You're suffering from shock. I must return to my flock. They'll stray without me. <sighs> Nice. Remember, Cheers, certain skulls are every bit as resistant as we are. Who are you? What do you mean by skull? You truly are a newborn. I should have realized. Wait. You, you are the woman from the bar. Are you like me? Can you help me? I believe, sir, I already have. Hmm. Well, sassy. It's how to like them. George and the Saints, you've solved the mystery of these terrible murders. Patience, good fellows, I've come to offer help. Just give me a moment to secure my boat. We can leave it's this back. awful place. William was not the evil man they claimed. He was just taken by the thirst. He needed his drink. This man requires medical attention. We'll see he gets to the nearest hospital. No, please, I almost tend to my fault. My flock needs me. <laughs> Go with the good Dr. Swansea. He's resourceful, and I'm sure he'll take good care of you. You'd best come as well. The sun is soon to rise, and you'll need a place to rest. I just need a moment. If I can learn something about what has happened to William, I'll be a step closer to understanding what happened to me. Oh, okay. This poor creature can't be my maker. Could it be some subspecies of vampire? I must find a place to analyze the blood. A dawn weaver. Off we go into the yonder. Where are we headed? We're on our way to the Pembroke Hospital. It's just across the canal. They'll have a bed for poor Mr. Hampton. William was... What manner of creature was he? Predator, prey, villain, and victim. Who can say? The important thing is that he's been stopped. Duly noted. And the woman? What? Who is she? What woman? Oh, don't play me for a fool. You used me to locate that skull. You must know who she is. And I thought you were a gentleman. You shouldn't talk about a lady behind her back. But I will tell you, she values her privacy. <laughs> Simp. Were London as peaceful as she appears from the middle of the canal? If only that were the reality yep, of the situation. Not. To be honest, I've always tried to avoid this part of town. Pembroke Hospital is the last bastion between the rest of London and the epidemic. The flu has decimated the East End and the war still rages. Welcome to the front lines of a plague. This is where you work, Dr. Swansea. I am the administrator of Pembroke Hospital. I thought you were here in service of your mysterious order, the Brotherhood of... Of St. Paul's Stone, yes. But first and foremost, I'm a man of science. A physician, like yourself, Dr. How, Reed. How, how do you know who I am? No need for modesty. You are Dr. Jonathan Reed, a surgeon of some caliber and renown, if I'm not mistaken. Well. You are correct, sir. I knew it. I had my suspicions. But when you took the blood sample from the corpse of poor William, I was certain. Dr. Reed, marvelous. Have we met? I attended three of your seminars before the war. I have the utmost admiration for your research. <laughs> and what a turn of fate. England's most esteemed blood specialist returns to London a vampire. <sighs> that word again, from a so-called man of science. 
I understand, traditionally the role of science is to refute myth, but when myth walks among us, the Brotherhood of St. Paul has dedicated well, its purpose it's to their some time. There's so much for you to learn. Of that, you are right. Well, then let me be blunt. Join my staff at Pembroke Hospital. As a physician. I suspect you'll not find a better post of employment to contemplate your uh, predicament. This is sudden. I was returning home to see my sickly mother. But alas, that was before contracting this... affliction. Dr. Reed, take a moment to consider. The post would be for the night shift, providing a good explanation for your absence during daylight hours. You'll be adequately reimbursed, and have a place to hide. I even had the forethought to bring some clean clothes. So, what do you say? Why the fuck not, I guess. It seems I have little choice, but yours is a generous offer, so I thank you. Brilliant! Oh, Jonathan, this is one for the book, and the beginning of a beautiful friendship. Thank God for that, that's the end of that cutscene, that was like dragon. That was a dragon hard. Thank goodness, I was beginning to be concerned. Worry no more, Nurse Crane, for I bring good news. Oh, Doctor, what a night. We lost two more patients. Nurse Scow said she couldn't take it anymore and resigned. Mm. Yes, well, I'll make a new rotor in the morning. In the meantime, find a oh, good bed for Mr. Hampton. Be sure to pay attention to his needs. Of course, Doctor. Oh, and Dorothy? Yes, Doctor? Dr. Reed here has just returned from the front. He served King Country and will be joining us here at Pembroke. We're very lucky to have gained a surgeon of his talent, and one so experienced in blood transfusions. That is good news indeed, Doctor. <laughs> oh, yes. Here at Pembroke, it's not what we have, but what we haven't. It's only thanks to Nurse Crane and the staff that our ship doesn't sink. If you have any questions, just ask her. Duly noted. Thank you. Your assistance is required, Dr. Swansea, immediately. Welcome aboard, Jonathan. We'll catch up after my rounds. Coming, Nurse Crane. I'm coming. All right. Nice. Home. Um, I've got the analytes when I'm in the hospital. Okay. We'll have a word in my office later, Jonathan. Oh, so I don't go up the stairs. I'm not meant to go up the stairs. I've just got to find it. You can do better than that. Now, it's my turn. Um. Rotten or crusty, each heart contains the of life. Drink at this river. Try it. Hmm. Oh, come on, you bastard. I won't bite. Sir, please. You've lost too much blood. Calm yourself. You think I didn't notice? Stop your staring and get me to an hospital, you ass. Insulting a good Samaritan. Not exactly the way to get rescued. All right, all right, sorry. I am in pain. My guts are spilling out onto the street and you're yabbering on. Yes. That's a very nasty wound you've got there. Take my word, I was... I am a doctor. Dr. Jonathan Reed. Mm-hmm. <sighs> Name's Clay Cox. All right, well, okay. Let's hope you don't, Clay. Follow me, Mr. Cox. Let me assist you to that better place. Hmm. 
Okay. Creepy. Where? Bring this fading light into the shadows. Dance with him the dance of life and death. Where is the shadow? Exactly. Oh, is this the red trail? Which way we're up? There we go. There. This way. Is it this way? Where? Which way is it? Where, where am I being led to here? Just anywhere? Oh, okay, here. Hmm. Bumba. That is. In the back, you bastard! Didn't have the guts to fart me. Fuck you! I'll kill you! I'll kill you! Uh, crazy. What is with this music? It's too much. Surely. Oh no. Smelling blood everywhere. Doctor, where have you been? I've little time to play hide and seek with new staff members, no matter how illustrious they may be. Mm. I apologize. Illustrious, say. I needed some time to myself. This has been the longest and strangest night of my life. You delivered poor Mr. Hampton from a terrible fate. The means to that end should be of little concern, Doctor. Thank you, Nurse. What can I do for you? Dr. Swansea insisted we provide you a quiet office. You'll find it on the second floor with your name on the door. Mm, nice Thank fancy you. office, eh? Nurse Crane, isn't it? Yes, Dorothy Crane. Welcome to Pembroke Hospital, Dr. Reed. Your office has been prepared. I would like to ask a few questions oh. first. What kind of man is Dr. Swansea? That's what like well, you know. accepted the job from him. I thought you would have known about your employer. Hmm. Touché. It's right to assume Dr. Swansea knows far more about me than I do about him. You'll get to know him soon enough, and better than me. The administrator has better things to do than mix with us. Oh dear. I don't need to know your personal shit. And Mr. Hampton, the patient we brought in. How does he fare? I gave him a sedative to help him sleep. Poor thing was in quite a mm. state of shock. Opium. If you could point me in the direction of my room again, nurse. Second floor of the hospital, left after the stairs. It's the last vacant office at the end of the corridor. Thank you, Nurse Crane. On the second floor here. Huh? Oh, I can't talk to these geezers Good as well. Huh? So it is true. The famous Dr. Reed has joined us. I can't think of any better <laughs> that than that during these no, terrible Do we know each other? it out. Actually, yes. <laughs> we met once before. She's bewitched. At the Rockefeller University in New York. Dr. Tippett, yes, I remember. He's distracted. I was assisting Professor Carell in his research about oh, coronary bypasses. Oh, finally went. He had nothing but praise for you. He was also very confident about your future. And look at you now. Eminent surgeon and blood transfusion specialist. What is the Pembroke Hospital situation? And please, speak freely. This hospital is not exactly the best of London, 
I'm sure you are used to working in a better environment. It's not exactly the best situation in London, either. I can't have expected this hospital to be prepared for what was to come. Don't be misled by appearances, Dr. Reed. This hospital does not lack talented people. It just mm -hmm. lacks hope. Fair. What can you tell me about the staff in the hospital? Some are really good, and others are not so good. But during this troubled period, there is no time for slander. I prefer to focus on the positive character traits. Oh, nice. Tell me more about cherished people, then. Nurse Branigan is a pearl. She is the most helpful and dedicated nurse I've ever worked with. A clever and cheerful woman. You really seem to admire her skills. Uh -huh. I'll go even further. If she was a man, she would be a damn fine practitioner. Any opinion about the management? I don't always agree with Dr. Swansea's reserve. But I must admit, he does all he can to keep this facility running during this crisis. Ah, yes, the burden of command. I was fed up with this concept while serving as a medical officer. Don't get me wrong. Swansea's a good administrator. I just wish he would get out of his office down again. <laughs> Shade. Goodbye, oh, oh, bye bye. Getting to know the gossip. Good evening, nurse. I'm Dr. Jonathan Reed, the new surgeon here at the Pembroke. Dr. Swansea has already told us about you, sir. I'm nurse Gwyneth Branigan. Welcome to the Pembroke Hospital. Did he really? It's a good thing I wasn't hoping to keep a low profile. All members of staff have already read about your new blood transfusion technique. Dr. Swansea made sure of that. I see. Well, I'm a little surprised. But I suppose I'll just have to deal with this unexpected notoriety. You mm -hmm. must know, blood transfusions are Dr. Swansea's primary subject of research. He is convinced it is the future. Why does Dr. Tippett's claim you're the main reason he keeps working, despite mm. his fatigue? Dun, dun, dun. If it wasn't for him, I probably would have left the Pembroke years ago. Dr. Tippetts does not think of you as just a nurse anymore, does he? If you're suggesting he's not taking my gender into consideration when it comes to medical practice and knowledge, I really hope he doesn't. <sighs> I'm not familiar with all the staff yet. Perhaps you could help me. Brilliant professionals. Yeah, Most dig us the dirt. Dr. Swansea has a gift for recruiting talent. Most of them. Is there a problem I should know about, nurse? It would be inappropriate for me to speak ill of a colleague. Nurse Brannigan, if you do know something, please tell me. Anything you yes, say please will tell me. in confidence. No. I may disagree with some conduct, but in the end, everybody is doing their best. Fair enough. I'm still going to push it more. I need to know. I'm going to be nosy. Is there anyone that stands out? Well, I have never met someone as dedicated as Dr. Tippett's. He should be a standard for us all here. If only he were younger. Why should his age be a problem? I guess it's fair to say he's always pushing himself to the limits. He just doesn't know when to stop and get some rest. Mm-hmm. How are things here? Not good, to say the least. We're struggling against an invisible enemy, more lethal than any bullet from a gun. It's hard, Doctor. What? An invisible enemy? Quite a poetic term for a disease, especially from a nurse. Sorry, Doctor. These last few weeks have been exhausting. We could all do with a good night's sleep. Hmm. Yeah, I've had enough Goodbye, of what she's nurse. got to say. Call me if you need assistance. 
Oh, we've been getting to know everybody. Do we talk to him? Do we? I mean, we could get him later. Good I could have to see This is the problem. I'm, I'm going to want to talk to everybody. I'm new here. I've already heard about you, Dr. Reed. I'm Milton Hooks, the ambulance driver for this shithole of a hospital. That's quite a blunt introduction, Mr. Hooks. You can call me Milton. I like to speak my mind, Dr. Reed. Perk of the job. Don't judge me, and I won't judge you. I'm not sure I understand what you're talking about. Well, I'm no doctor, but I'm pretty sure a gun can't be used as a surgical instrument. You have a keen eye. I learned to shoot during the war, and have carried one ever since. Old habits die hard. No need to explain, Dr. Reed. And if you ever need a better gun, remember, I may have something for you. <laughs> I'd like to see your goods. Wise choice, Dr. Reed. A reliable gun is what everybody needs these days. No way. Was actually going to talk to you there, mate. Good evening, Doctor. Still trying to save lives. Are you really smuggling weapons through the hospital? And why not? I've already been attacked by patients, you know. And by gang members willing to steal my money. But you're not defending hmm. yourself. You're selling guns to civilians. You keep people alive your own way, Doctor. I offer them another way to protect their health. Yeah. So what do you do exactly in the Cold system? steel. Apart from smuggling guns, I mean. I've been an ambulance driver since... too long, I guess. I bring sick people here night and day. It's a dirty job, but I get it done. Most of the time. Since you're on the front line, how is the sanitary situation in this vicinity? It's a complete disaster. It's even getting dangerous to enter some streets or buildings. Even the locals attack you. Mm. It sounds like things have been a bit rough recently. What's happened? Yesterday I got attacked by the patient I was bringing in. I escaped through the hospital's garden, but I lost my wallet when I was running. You left an infected patient outside the hospital. That's incredibly dangerous. Go there yourself if you want, but be careful, doctor. I'd rather not bring your dead body back. Oh, How is the sick. situation around here? You want to hear the situation is all right? It's fucking awful. We lack everything. And it's getting worse every day. Okay. Goodbye, Milton. Bye-bye. Oh, okay. Nice. A small bottle. Dr. Swansea is right. This place seems perfect to conduct my research. No. Who are you? Good evening, miss. Crazy I'm Dr. Person. Reed, the new surgeon at the Pembroke Hospital. And who are you? Your name has no meaning to me, mortal. <laughs> You're nothing but dust blown by the winds of eternity. I beg your pardon? What are you begging for, mortal? My clemency. Well, tonight maybe I'm inclined to mercy. You'll never forget the night you met Thelma Howcroft. You keep hmm. calling me mortal. Why is that? And if I'm mortal, what are you? Well, Dr. Reed, if you must know, I'm a vampire. Who are you really, Miss Howcroft? I mean, apart from being a vampire. Is that not enough for you, puny mortal? What do you require? Hmm? Proof of my powers? I'm curious to know who you were before becoming a vampire. Can't. No, it was such a long time Girl, ago. Is she serious as it think she is? Centuries of unholy life can have strange effects on one's minds, you see? And why do you believe you're a vampire? I don't need to believe anything. It is what I am. It is what I feel within this hollow shell of flesh. Mm. 
Please, describe to me how you feel. What is it like to be a vampire? I can hear my body crumble from the inside as my flesh cracks and fades. I sense the last pulse of postulant blood within my drying veins. I need new blood. Hmm. I've heard of this crazy. Have you ever heard of Cotard syndrome, Miss Howcroft? Never. It's a mental illness discovered by a French neurologist named Jules Cotard. The affected patients are delusional. They believe that they are putrefying, that they are dead, a, a ghost or a ghoul, or in your case, a vampire. Delusional, you say? Oh, sad and hmm. petty mortal. You can't even begin to understand the concept of immortality. And you think it is I who am delusional. I'm assuming you must be a patient here. Am I right, Miss Howard? It's only a cover to hide from my enemies. I can leave whenever I want. As a woman, a, a spirit, fog, or bat. <laughs> the staff here are not your enemy. They're here to help you, to care for you. I'm not speaking of the doctors in the night. Hmm. I'm speaking of the women who hunt me, for I am a vampire. I see. Don't worry. These people will not find you here. I'll personally make sure they leave you alone. Well, she is Thank then. you, mortal. But do not interfere with them, for you are no match for those that hunt me. Who are these enemies you mentioned? Can you describe them? I cannot say for sure. But I sense their eyes on me from nearby. I, I, I feel them watching me every time I visit the garden near the morgue. I'll leave you, Mistress of the Dark, to your <laughs> internal activity. Cute. Not now. Oh, well, we're this way. Not now. <laughs> this it. This must be the oh, place. It's... it's definitely away from oh. prying eyes. Pretty. Relegated to the shadows. A kingdom of my own. At least I won't be sleeping in a coffin. Yeah, there's that. Flowers dying. It needs water. Can we go feed it? No. That would have been cute. I'd love to upgrade this, but it won't actually let me do it. William Bishop's blood is much more unstable than human blood and shows extensive mutation. But this. So, how do I change? Oh, I've actually got on me. Can I do that? The sun is about to rise. 
I can feel it. I'll continue tomorrow night. I have so much time. Yum, 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 yum. Stay here until my research is complete. I'd better learn to. Hide my true nature from the mortals. Alright guys, I'm just gonna go to the toilet and stuff, but I'll be back in a sec.
Well, hello, I'm back. Came back with some cookies and some milk because I'm a damn adult and I can have what I want. I'm just going to have a cookie before we start this next bit, alright? We've got about, I don't know, let's say 25 minutes left. Um, now would be a good time. Oh, we're all having our snack break to remind you guys that um, if you support what I'm doing and like my content, um, you have to follow my Twitch page, please and subscribe to my YouTube account because all my content goes up on there as well and um, sometimes I do special things on there um, and again sorry about not being on Minecraft um, we're just doing something a little bit different today I wanted to play this game um, apologize for me eating with my mic oh that's good that's good Not gonna do too much eating. <laughs> Sorry about that. Just needed that cookie goodness. Mhm. Mm right, where am I going? This way. There was a door. Here. It's freezing here. Yep. Sup. Yes, Nurse Crane. How can I help you? 
I'm so sorry. I know Dr. Swansea wanted you to rest, but we have somewhat of a crisis. Hot, 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 a hot, crisis, hot. you say? Our supply of antiseptics is nearly depleted. I was hoping there was another box up here, but... What type of hospital are you running? No antiseptics. Oh, oops. You have been away too long, Doctor. With the war and now this epidemic, supplies have been running scarce for months yeah, now. Come on, Doc. I may have a solution. Crash. In France, during the war, drug shortage was a daily problem, and we had to use our wits to overcome the shortages. However do you mean? If combined correctly, certain household chemical products can be used in a pinch instead. Now, where's the hospital storeroom? The storeroom? Fat chance. This is the Pembroke, and space is luxury we don't have. Mm -hmm. Okay. Everything used to be stored in the old morgue. Perhaps I should look there first. Where is this morgue? It's the large building behind the hospital. You'll need to go in the back door because it's been sealed off for sanitary reasons. Oh, some good Take cookie. This it opens a small back entrance at the end of a narrow street. The abandoned mall behind the hospital. A small door at the end of a narrow street. On my way. Yeah. Thank you, nurse. Okay. Ooh, pretty. Hacksaw head. The thing is, I don't actually know how to switch the weapons. I need to find that out. Find out in the options. Come on, let's go. I have it in there. And play. See, I thought this, but <laughs> how is that doing anything? I don't know. I don't know why that's not doing it. Oh well, we'll find out. I haven't got time to figure things out. I only have time to do things. I'm just such a lot of stuff to look at. This is gonna be a trap for me. Is locked. Okay, I'm assuming it's not that way. Scowl voices in the garden. Hmm. I should investigate. If they were to find somebody. How oh, cute. Right, okay. I really want to use the scythe. Oh, scary. 
So I've got to eat them before they go crazy. So let's just let's just have a look at this. Okay. Hmm. Fair enough. Three had other bits for me, maybe not. Creepy. This is spooky. as they are ineffective but they do contain iron tartrate and that might prove itself useful okay Anything else in there oh you had something you have something Surely grant me access to the basement. Never know. Creepy. These scowls feed from corpses and the husks of animals.
Ooh. Intense. Mr. Connor's injuries don't match the report. I'd better look into this. I wonder if there's a way to unlock it. So we came out this way. <sighs> do, 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 do. I really don't know if I'm going to be able to do this. I'm going to have to keep dodging around forever. I should have really paid attention to the mechanics. Because I didn't. And I'm afraid that I'm going to die. Yeah, see, I knew it. I knew it. I have one more go and then I'm going to come off, guys. But... It was a good game while we were at it. Yeah, okay, cool, beans. We've done it before, we can do it again. again shall we oh dear really
<laughs> Close. <sighs> so, oh, okay, so it's, it's oh, locked, no. all right. Dead, yeah, duh. I killed him. I don't like this, it's very hard. Difficult. I'm going to have to think about it and do it tomorrow. But yeah, anyway, guys, it was a nice uh, gaming with you guys. If you did like my content, please like, share, follow. Uh, definitely follow. You're watching it now, so you kind of have to. Um, yeah, please like, donate by going on my About page on Twitch and going on the, the tip jar. Um, click on the banner and it'll send you where you can send me a tip um, you can always donate me games or whatever that's also cool um, and yeah like a comment I think I said that already go over to my YouTube page subscribe to me there um, yeah let's let's uh, try and get people uh, following thanks anyway so yeah anyway good night hope you had as uh, good a time as I did on our new cam and I'll see you again soon this has been your boy Bronson Kush. See you later.